How's it going, boys? Today, I have found something interesting, unique. And when I say I found, I mean someone at Discord PM'd me and showed me this card, Illicit Masquerade. And then I started looking at it and I was like, wait a minute, I have never seen this card before. How is that possible? It's from one of the newest sets, if not the newest set, in fact. Like, I would know set icons, how they look. I know, we're not working with a lot here, but we're working with what we got, boys. In any case, so I decided to make a deck around this, because this card's effect is pretty good. And shoutouts to the person who added me and showed me this card, because I lost the conversation and I can't find you, because my Discord's actually pretty large, strangely enough. In any case... Now you're not just the hero, you're the nameless hero, which sounds a lot cooler, honestly, right? In any case, this is what Illicit Masquerade does, because no one probably knows. It's a 4-cost enchantment that has flash. Whenever it comes on the battlefield, your stuff gets an imposter token. And wh that means, whenever any creature that you possess with an imposter uh, token dies, it gets exiled, which is bad. But there's a bright side, a really good bright side, in fact. And when it, that happens, you get to return any creature from your graveyard to the battlefield. Which means, if we play Illicit Masquerade, a bunch of 1-drops or 2-drops, like you're doing the Skull Dweller, the Doggo, and the Deep Cave Bat, well, we got a lot of sackable material. Also, this has, you know, uh, a little bit of that Surveil magic, which is amazing. And, you know, then we can even use Cemetery uh, Tampering, which is a card no one probably also has ever seen played in the history of ever. But it's possible with things like Skull Dweller because Tox uh, Toxic 1. Amazing. In any case, we get our big cards in the graveyard. That is Shreldred, uh, that is the Bat God, that is another Shreldred, and the big, big ones, Vein Rippers. We also have Pyrexian Flesh Gorgers and a Toxo Thrill, because why not? Honestly, from the big cards, it can be pretty much anything you choose. It's gonna be fine, don't worry about it. Admittedly, at the same time, this is more of a meme deck, so, you know, it is what it is. Don't expect a 100% win rate or anything, except... Expect fun, okay? That's what you should expect. And we also have things like Pyrexian, they're into draws cards and Chimmel, because why not at this point, right? Anyway, 24 lands to be specific, 3.4 average mana cost, but it's not the worst case scenario. In any case, without being said, without any further ado, let's just get a Kraken and see what happens. Almost a curve. I almost like it. No, actually, this is a pretty decent opening hand. If we can get this on the field fast, one, our opponents are probably going to think that we're playing Golgari, uh, two... Well, actually, that sentence is way too smart for me, so I'm, 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 I'm kind of, I'm kind of, you know, down bad on the two. But it is what it is. Do this and see what happens. What do we got here? Uh, pain. Oh, wow, perfect hand. Thank you very much. How about you just don't, okay? <laughs> another bad, wait. Another bad actually works. Sure. Do I attack? Uh, no. Because he might attack. I mean, he does have the Knight of, of Woes, so that's kind of bad for us. But we do have a Shrelded, so if we get enough sauce here, that's going to be kind of good. Huh. Yeah, he plays that, that's to be expected. But does he have anything else to offer? Another! Okay, that's, that's, that's cool, that's cool. <sighs> Why? Why does every single guy like this just have, you know... This, this, and, well, this card in their opening hand. Why? It's just, I, I feel it's a little bit unnecessary and arguably unfair, Wizards, but, you know, I'm just, I'm just the guy. And, you know, it is what it is. Anyway, at least I can ditch this, so, you know, he's probably not feeling good about his life choices. Well, he's probably feeling good about his life choices. I'm not, though. In any case, we are getting some stuff done here. And this is annoying, so... He's going to be stalled for a couple of turns, and we have a Shreldred. We actually do have an advantage in this situation, as strange as that may sound. And the advantage just completely went out the window. What a time to be alive. Oh, why? Every single person that plays this shitty build literally has the same opening against me. Varden, this guy, this, and this. 
How? How does every single one of them just constantly keep doing it? Okay, gonna attack because this is kind of my last shot at attacking. The good part is even if he gets flying, I mean, I'm gonna be kind of chilling and killing for a small amount of time, so it's good. Okay, the question is how much we can do here. Do you think we're drawing a third shoulder? Oh, <laughs> Because why not, obviously. Because why not? I mean, it is what it is. I like the fact that this doesn't also tap when you do that, which is, you know, a balance in all things, wizards. Now, the good part from that is I can literally just attack with the Shreldred. And this. Actually, no, I'm not gonna attack with that. I can attack with both of these and, well, he can't block and he can't do anything. Man, I hate when these people just get uh, get the perfect openers. It pisses me off to an incredible degree. I'm sure it pisses everyone off, though. Man, 6 HP left. He can't tap this again. He's act... Hmm, that's kind of not bad for the situation, not gonna lie. Okay. That's annoying, but I, I think we're kind of fine for the time being. He's gonna tap these, but that, does that even matter? I mean, he has only six life left at this point, so... It's not like he's having a jolly of a good time. Okay, who decided to give the shit vigilance, though? Hmm? Who? I, I called it, didn't I? I? I called it, boys. It's it's another shrewdred! What? A, I should have attacked probably with everything. No, 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 attacking with everything would just open up me for dead here. You need to block, chief. Yeah. It is what it is. Wait, actually, that shredder didn't even die. Well, in that case, I mean, why not? <laughs> it's not gonna change much anyway. So, 4 HP left. It's down to the wire, boys. It's down to the wire. Hunter Musil. What a name. And, well, he didn't actually get anything that I cared about too much. Oh, wait, that's a lot of damage, though. Okay, okay. He's not drawing lands also, which... Giga Chad, I guess. If I block with a this bat, I don't think he... Yeah, I don't think he can do anything if I block with that bat. Admittedly, everything I currently kind of have is uh, slightly, fully pointless. Okay. Got one HP, what a time to be alive. He can technically play this, but then he's actually kind of dead, I think. Ah, he doesn't do anything, but natural. Okay, it is what it is. We got the uh, thing thingy, so let's hope for the best, I guess. Let's see, what do we get? Um, sure. I mean, we're never going to get it at this point. But, might as well, honestly, might as well. Do I attack? No. Do I win next turn? I... Unl unless he... Okay, unless he draws another one of these, I think I win. He can't crack open the blood token. This doesn't draw... This, this is a look effect, right? Yeah, look. Okay, so, what's the play here on each one? Are you gonna YOLO for... <sighs> I said, as long as he just doesn't do that, we're completely fine. And guess what he does? Exactly the one thing that I told him not to do. It's like he doesn't even listen. And so, now he should be attacking with everything because I'm dead. But there is a giga, ch giga, giga possibility, chance... That he's gonna completely bonk it up now. No, uh, no, no, still dead. Uh, completely useless play. I, I, I guess it's not completely useless because he could have still dropped something that costs like one. Uh, but I mean, who cares? And he just attacks with everything. Why does this build constantly get an opener of this, this, plus this, plus this? I have questions, wizards. Sadly, did not survive. Well, I mean, that's what happens. Close. 
close. Not actually close, but close. Close. Double God Hound. Believe it or not, that's actually a pretty relatively good start. We can do a lot with this. So, let's hope for the best and see how it goes. Also, put the cat on purple. Sunset Reverie. Cute. Cute. Okay, we do have a on curve Shialdred. Do I need this? Nope. So let's ditch it. I don't need too much of this, right? In any case, uh, looks... Th is this... Is this classic control Orzov with Kaya? Uh, no. Uh, the correct answer to that is uh, no, it doesn't look like it. But yeah, so let's do this. Let's see the bat. What can we find here? Well, that's a bag and a half of question, question mark. At least he can reanimate that, which is kind of big for him, not gonna lie. Um, sure, I definitely kind of need that at some point, right? He doesn't have any real plays. He can do that, he's probably gonna do it for that, but I don't think that does too much. It's a slightly annoying, a hindrance, a nuisance, but as long as he just doesn't get lands too much, I think we can just stalemate this for now. We do have the Shreldred play, which is amazing, technically. So, yeah, I could actually already drop the Masquerade down next turn. Eh. Well, easily, well, that's an easy Shreldred to honestly get back, so, you know, it's not that bad. He attacks. What else do we have here? Still a bat. Hmm. I'm fine with this, kinda. More stuff, huh? Nope, no attacks. I do have... I could talk so... I could wait for a Toxo Trill, maybe. The Toxo Trill is gonna be super annoying for him with the uh, human tokens because it's gonna get rid of them. Options are here, boys. Options are definitely here. He doesn't have too much else now uh, kind of going for him. I wonder if he's do gonna double attack. Because if, if it's just one, I can... Hmm. Sus. He does have reanimation. Do I just wait this out? Or do I drop the... Hmm, I guess I just wait it out. Yeah, he's not attacking with those, so I guess waiting it out is kind of the right choice, to a degree. Oh, well, land, okay, waiting it out was definitely not a bad choice in that case. So, let's see what he does here. A, a red land? Ooh, ho 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 ho. Okay, by the way, this could work with uh, so many different self-mills now, if I think about it. It's kind of crazy. But in any case, that may be for another day. Oh, he attacks with everything. Should I? I can't use the sacrifice effect for the slugs, though. That's kind of annoying. Yeah, let's do this now. I think we need to. Also, this is going to prevent further aggression, technically, to a degree. And, you know, now we're going to get gain a little bit more out of this. So it's not exactly that bad. Okay, hopefully he doesn't have a way to deal with that because, well, he has only one card there. Doesn't have too much. Hmm. That's a not bad card for the situation. Okay, easy attacks are easy. And now everything gets a little bit of a counter. Slugs, 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 not bad. Also, do we want that? Probably no, probably no. Okay, deal some damage, gain some health, drop this, probably flip, and a depopulate, which is very cute, but at the same time, that just means Toxo Trill is back, baby. So, all of his play, uh, all of his plays are relatively useless. Relatively useless. Plus, I can do this now. So we're kind of popping off here, boys. Uh, big attacks. Can't wait. Shouldn't have not done that though. Well, we're gonna see because if he actually gets Kaya minus my Toxo Trill, I will be severely, 
unhappy about life. Okay? Beyond severely unhappy with life, by the way. Extremely beyond unhappy with life, by the way. So yeah, let's just do this. And what else? Probably nothing. Destroying his chances for other things, I guess, is a smart play. So let's just do it like that. Let's see. Let's get a land. Hmm. Wait, I should probably just attack with everything. In case he does get the Kai. He, he is on five lands. He doesn't have a Kai in the graveyard, though. He goes for that type of an exchange. Yeah, that's... Oh, wait, 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 wait. That's bad. I forgot that this has lifelink. Shouldn't have probably done that. I know. What a time to be smart about things. He can technically go and do the flip here, but he doesn't want to do that because of Toxo Thrill. Man, Toxo Thrill is still an amazing card. It still is just so dumb sometimes. It's it's glorious. Okay, uh, cute. Yeah, you can you can do that, Chief. Thumbs up. Double thumbs up, in fact. What a play, said a lot of people. Okay, so now this prox. This gets weaker. He has for some... Well, he would have already dropped her. Okay. No, don't feel too impressed about that one, Chief. Oh, wait, that happened first? That's slightly annoying. Well, whatever, I guess. So do this. What do we want? A Batso. Because I want to see what he's cooking here, okay? I want, I want to see that cook station. And what a station indeed that is. A lot of cooking has been cooking. A uh, vein ripper. Yes, 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 daddy. Okay, attack with everything because I'm feeling a little bit confidente. Uh, that's fine if you want to do that. Still gonna get the minus counters. So he can win with a little bit of luck. It's because he just needs to Kaya and get the Toxo Thrill. That is the big play. But if I get to drop the Vein Ripper, he kind of just dies. This dies next turn so I can freely attack. Unless he gets something really, really super solid here. We're in a good spot. We're in a really good spot. Cycling, he can't get anything. Oh no, it's completely Joker, boys. It's Joker for him. What a time to be alive. Okay. Drops that. Why do you have all these colors, though? What, 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 what sense does that make? In any case, here, here's a freebie real estate slug token. And here's a freebie real estate, whatever you want to call that. Ah, oh, yeah, baby. Ah, oh, yeah. And now I can do this. Because why honestly not? Either at this point it's going to work wonders or it's not going to work at all. Ah, uh, choices were made. Choices were definitely made. I feel like an attack with everything, right? Okay, so... Okay, that's that's fine. How much HP does he have? Not a lot. Not a lot. Good game. Now, the point is... Farewell, the obvious card of the skill, can still happen. I hope it doesn't, because that would be sad. But... That is. Oh, wait, no, there's no chance. His best play is uh, Persistence. Okay, I mean, he tried. I don't know why he has more colors uh, in his deck than the rainbow, but, you know, he, he, it is something. So, yeah, now just the Vayne Ripper can easily win. Okay, well, that's, that's kind of cool. Oh, that's a nice additive. Why honestly not? There we go. Uh, Vein Ripper procs all day long, baby. And he surrenders. Good game. Pyrexian Arena and Shreldred. Cute, honestly. I like it. Cat on purple. And let's see what he plays. Not... Ooh, wait, is that dinosaurs? There's no way that's dinosaurs. If it is, this is a good start. By the way, by the way. I often... This card is still so underrated. Admittedly, it's kind of hard to put in. Oh, wait, what the hell is that? Is that dinosaurs or dinosaurs with extra steps? Hum. In any case, this card. Yeah, this card is so, so unbelievably underrated. Because it's free 
constant removal, a one for one card exchange, and it has the ninjutsu part. So you can have this on something with one and toxic, or you know, death touch, or you can have it on something with flying. So it is kind of unbelievably good, actually, in so many situations. Okay, we're kind of popping off here, boys. I like this. I like this. Not gonna do that. I actually... Wait, maybe I should... No, 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 no. We're just gonna drop this and then see how it goes. He's gonna take damage... Co he has the removal. But it's a sorcery. Also, nice card back, dude. Nice. In any case... Card back may be nice, but you know, this avatar isn't. You should feel bad about yourself. So he's taking damage no matter what. Now I can actually cast this because, you know, there's a little bit of a reason. Yeah, this is three colored dinosaurs, but we could have pro- Whoa! Chief, relax, okay? Relax. I wonder if he will attack. No. I think I also could be absolutely wasted here because, um, yeah. Well, I am gaining 3 HP per turn, so this is not the end of the- Oh! That is actually big. That is actually so unbelievably big for our situation. Okay, uh, good, 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 and highway. What do we get? Uh, you're kind of cheeks, I, I, I like it. Okay, so what do we do now? Nothing. If he gets rid of the Shreldred, though, and double attacks, I can easily cast this next turn on just one because we have the value of removal plus the flesh, flesh gorger. So we do have some very, very cheeky, uh, cheeky things here that can be done. Hmm. Ha! Huh. If a permanent enters the battlefield, causes triggered abilities of permanent you to control the trigger. Oh wait, does that not actually apply to this? I think it doesn't. Does it? Huh, wait, why are you playing these with this? This is a Pyrexian. You put the... I'm, com I'm confused. Slightly confused. Well, okay, a lot of confused, not gonna lie, boys. So what's the play here? What, what What is the idea? Man, I like looking at this card back. Only hot card backs should be allowed, boys, by the way. I just want to point that out, okay? Um, one block, two block. Do I actually do it? I probably don't block the Sheldred. Hmm. If he wants to exchange like that, I'm kind of for it. Okay, nice. Not bad, not bad. Take action, obviously. Uh, not the greatest mill in the universe, in the multiverse, but it's actually not that bad. Okay, if I drop a vein ripper, just do I just win? Or do I do this and then ninjutsu it? Now, I think I drop a vein ripper just to threaten his existence. This is perfect. <laughs> Ah, oh, Vayne Rippers. This hot god has a lot of charm in some certain situations. Not every situation by far, but definitely has some charm in some specific situations. So, do I drop this in Ninjutsu? Oh, wait. Oh, no, 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 no. Hmm. How do we even play this? We're gonna mill with this, so an insurance policy with this would not be bad. Attack is attacking with the vein ripper and then jutsuing and sacking the flesh gorger actually our best play, boys. Also, I kinda like that. Pretty saucy, not gonna lie. Okay, that's a lot of stuff that I'm unhappy about. Oh. Oh that's bad. Do you think he's just gonna get the the big saucer? I think he's gonna get the big sauce boy. Also, hide away procs two times, so there's no world where he doesn't get a tally. So the question now becomes, what's well, what's the play? A tally's danger zone. The good part is, I guess, that it's not attacking. Hmm. Okay, I need a big mill. Obviously, Italia is obvious. Blah, blah, blah. 
Great stuff, blah blah blah. If you steal my Toxo Trill, though, I will be absolutely livid, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. So. I need to get this, so I can discuss- It- No, but I can't just- <sighs> Of course, but naturally, why not? Shit on a stick. Well, I'm playing shit on a stick also, so I can't really complain too much, can I? And not really, I'm playing bigger shit on a stick, so it is what it is. In any case, a tally pops and useless. I like it, I like it. But what else, though? What else? Another Elshnon. Okay, another Elshnon, though, is super weak, so. Ulu. <sighs> What's the play, though? I need to mill something amazing. He's probably not attacking with El- Ah! Did some damage! He got talked. Oh no, he didn't get talked. Wait, what did he get? Did he get my Masquerade? I think he did. Oh, and then Dude, what is this garbage? I- We have seen this before. It's- It's some- It's people playing a Johnny- What the hell is this? I mean, that's beyond cute, honestly. Completely ineffective also, but- Cute. Okay, I can't block because, uh, trample. But then again, next turn he still tramples me and that's a problem. He plus ones? What? Serial? Huh. Why? Also, this, uh, this is Johnny got a unique animation, which makes no sense because... This was clearly one of the worst, most specific planeswalkers by far, which makes it kind of bad and it's hilarious. Anyway, okay, milled nothing. What a time to be a time. Um, got something. I think we just cast this because we, we can't play. Dude, he played our combo before us. From 1 to 10, pretty pissed. You know? Not happy. In any case... We now have this, which means uh, attacking us with that is not the super most effective thing in the universe. And then we're going to be able to play this plus these two, right? Probably. We're getting one land, right? So, okay, as good as it gets. Attacking us is super awkward, though. Is he, do you think he's going to wait for the Atali transformation and just YOLO into us? Whenever uh, you cast a creature or a planeswalker, I don't even care about the salty. N well, neither does he, honestly. But we have seen this before. We have we have seen people play this absolute disaster. This is crazy that people just play this disaster for no reason. I I, I can't get over it. Also, if he attacks with everything, he's actually kind of smart. But I don't think we die, so. If he, no, wait, if he attacks us with everything, uh, he dies because reasons. Vein Ripper reasons. So that's good. Man, this went out of control real fast, huh? I don't know what to do. This guy doesn't know what to do. We're kind of both stumped on not knowing exactly what the hell is even happening. Okay, he decided to put more stuff on Atali. What a hero. Well, at least he decided... Oh, wait, he's actually YOLO 420 blazing as boys are really hard. Okay, do this. Do this. Do this. Uh, 16. Oh, actually, wait, it, all of this survives. That's not bad, that's not bad. Yeah, we survive. What the hell? 16? Am I missing anything? No, we actually survive. Well, now, that was a bit unexpected, not gonna lie. And this survives, which is probably the uh, most hilariously best part about this. And now, a lot of damage. Well, technically, he gets stuff back. He gets a lot of stuff back, actually. Oof. Wait, no, he doesn't get a lot of stuff back. This gets exiled. This gets exiled. So maybe he misclicks and does dumb stuff? I don't know. 
Wait, no. Does the egg cell even work that way? I have never tried. Well, I'm gonna have a skull crawler, so he's out of options, and he cannot flip this just yet. Well, he just got a lot of stuff out, but the vein ripper procs still have not happened. Okay. I mean, first the vein ripper procs, then we can deal with all of the other shenanigans. There's a lot of vein ripper procs, my dude. We we did we we did a lot there. Admittedly, I'm taking one damage from this, but we should be fine. So that's how much life? 10? 12? Not sure how many procs did we get. In any case... Survivability. Okay, 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 what, did got, what got exiled? Wait, didn't this have a counter on it? I'm confused. Well, he no longer... Dude, do you think he has another one? There's no way, right? That would be just absolutely too much. For little old me, old me to handle. He can't get rid of the Vein Ripper, probably. Well, maybe he can. Who honestly knows at this point? But... This is a VOD 7. Life. He's taking his sweet time, that's for sure. Okay, uh, I mean, that's a lot of damage you just took, my sweet dear summer child. Okay, do that. A land. I told you we're gonna get the boys. I told you we're gonna get it, and we got a gone dindly gone it. Okay, drop this. Do that. Amazing. 10 out of 10. What an elaborate play. And do this. So. Oh, that's bad. Am I dead? I don't think so. Dude, so... If a permanent enters the battlefield, call a causes a triggered ability of a permanent you control to trigger... So, you're telling me this permanent entering the battlefield... Oh! Oh, I see why they worded it that way. Okay, that makes sense, I guess. Okay, so, we're absolutely boned, I guess. Dude, just attack me. You have, you, wait, can you not transform? Nope, still one man off, I guess. You could just probably drop a lane and kill those or me. Okay, okay, that's, that, now that's just unnecessary. Okay, what the hell is this build? It's stupid, it literally doesn't work, and people who play it should feel bad about themselves. Uh, so what the hell is this? I mean, this loses against literally every normal aggro deck in, you know, the history of ever, ever. Wait, am I alive? Yeah, I'm actually still alive. Shit, boy. Oh, and now he decides to do the plus one, which would allow him to transform Metali. Genius. Absolutely genius. And yeah, now he chooses to not do it like that. I guess that's fine. I guess that's fine. Hmm. Oh, wait, no, if it's a cre- Okay, 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 my bad. He couldn't actually get it. Oh, man, the, f the fact that he actually- When your enemy plays accidentally, your combo better than you because it happens. Man, those are painful days, boys. But it is a super meme deck, so, you know, it is what it is. But admittedly, I see a future where we could potentially do some wiki-wooey, you know, stuff with this and it kind of works out. So, yeah. Well, this is definitely us being completely melted. Six minus, yeah, the triggers are not gonna happen. GG! Good game! Was fun! A bat in a flesh gorger. Huh, interesting. Ooh, nice! This could work nicely now. Well, we admittedly need a little bit more sauce here, but, you know, this could work nicely. Let's start off with the bat. I want the information now. Aha! Uh -huh. Very interesting. Well, this is also... Well, not interesting. This is just annoying. Well, I guess he's gonna play that on turn 3. A rare person who plays the greedy freebooter. Yeah, that's a nice card. It's a little bit of niche of a card, but you know, it's, it's nice, I guess. 
In any case, oh, four lands. Now we're talking. Now we're now, now we're now we're doing things, boys. Okay. All I need to do, honestly, now is get something in the graveyard, and we can kind of do this. Oh wow, what is this? Hmm. Suspect. I mean, we could. Ca no, wait, no. This is the imposter token. There's the difference. Someone once told me. Don't know what the difference is, don't know why it exists, but it is what it is. Anyway. So, we got a decent lineup here. If he... Well, he's taking damage. A land, a field of ruin, and a mitrex. Not bad, let's put the cat on purple. Oh, 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 field of ruin for field of ruin. What a time to be alive, boys. What a time to be alive. Okay. Also, by the way, I'm gonna try this with tokens. Why token life generation? Hmm? Well, that's a choice and a half. Just, just gave me free HP. I don't even know. <laughs> he just gave me free HP. I, well, what am I supposed to do about that? I don't know. Uh, he, it, it's his choice at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? Anyway, let's see that. Oh, a vein ripper. A very veiny. Uh, how about no, though? Okay, so, at that, wait, he actually has graveyard destruction, which means this is a problem. Oh, man, this is, this is questionable. He can actually search also anything he pleases, so I wonder what that's gonna be. He probably wants to attack with this because that's just free real estate. Do you think this is going to be a land? Okay. I think it's a land. It's not a land. Oh. Boys. We be doing things. Ah, uh, Chimil. Yes, that seems fine. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, let us keep attacking with the bats. Let's keep on pressuring. Again, by the way, this is a meme win condition currently. So, you know, we can win with this, but it's hard to put in the graveyard. And then only in historic we could do so. Oh! Oh my. Well, now there's stuff in the graveyard at the bare minimum. What can I say? There's a lot of stuff in the graveyard also. So the problem is, how do we deal with the vein ripper take action? land land oh man that was actually a pretty bad thing well you know what this is actually not even that bad you know why do this and then i can actually do that and let's see what we can get here a flesh gorger and that honestly not currently that impressive i mean we're gonna mill or continue milling with this cemetery mirror really now I would have expected him to play Shredder at because reason. Hmm. Is he gonna choose this card on both sides? That's crazy. Doesn't this card Shredder it though? Hmm. Yeah, I was kind of expected. Mill, mill, mill. Okay, that's fine. A Shredder it again. Well, it's gonna be his Shredder. I need six. This mill. This doesn't mill three. Uh, 20 or more hmm oh no three cards it is it is actually that okay uh take action for show all lands pretty good shimmel for freebies draw nothing what a time to be a police sheltered um put in hand i guess thank you <laughs> that was not impressive okay okay uh yeah he can dude he's just wait is he an idiot I mean, yeah, sure. You could just do that and it's kind of free real estate, you know? You could have just kind of had us there, honestly. Uh, but instead, you kind of dis decided to be disappointing. What a time to be alive. Also, most of my lanes are still in, which means technically the this is good, but I'm not gonna do it. A bat! Yeah, that kind of solves some of my issues on a technical level. Okay, let's see. The end. Okay, uh, no end for you. A vein. Alright, oh, the vein ripper cannot be used. Ah, it is what it is! Okay, 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 this is fine. 
They're dealing damage. They're dealing damage. Man, he completely shreked our golden goose of a combo, boys. We were so close. And then we were so far. Well, if we would have put it out previously, it would just, you know. Mm. Well, it is what it is. He goes for the Shrilled, obviously. Mm. Not good. I mean, he... We could have been in this situation, but instead we're not actually in that situation. Sag. Kind of Sag. And now he minuses two if he feels like it and he gets... Okay, so he can obviously completely counter us. This is what happens when you play memes, boys. Okay, cool. I guess we got a card that does card things. Let's see. Another one. Well, that's not actually that bad considering everything. Oh my, are you kidding me? When was this at the start, you shit game? Man, that is annoying. Well, what can we do now, though? I have a feeling not much. Wrinkles, prank him. Okay. <laughs> Doesn't achieve much, but honestly, I think we're kind of dead. I think we are kind of dead here, boys. Uh, he's gonna get everything back, which includes... Yeah, he doesn't actually have it. Well, whatever. Decline, it doesn't matter. Decline, and yes, play the doggo. Land? Land! Okay, so we do this. Amazing, I know. And let us get out... Well, this, but what is that gonna accomplish, really? Oh, another one! How is this going so poorly, though, honestly, at this point? Well, if I give him the bat... Well, it doesn't matter if we give or don't give him the bat. Well, that's... That's that's my whole board right there. Ooh, ooh. Hmm. Very cute. Yeah, I don't think we win this one, boys. Doesn't look like that at all. I think I'm gonna press the concede button now. One turn away, boys. One turn. 